Yesterday, while scrolling through social media, I discovered two videos of National Party activists being harassed on the streets of Fibsborough for the crime of peacefully distributing leaflets. Before presenting the video for you to view, I will first share a Twitter thread created by the group known as Anti-Fascist Ireland. As usual, references made to hate are present in the thread, which of course means that special dispensation must be granted to those who would employ the use of force and intimidation to chase away their ideological opposition. Racist bigots. Blow in racist bigots. Blow, blow, blow in racist bigots. Little fuckers don't know what Fisbra's about. Trying to do more Fisbra. Little bigots. No, I'm just keeping record of you. I hope you put up the social media. What's, what's filming what's us going to do? Careful what you're doing, all right? Oh, careful what you're doing. You got a fucking run out of here. Look at here, look at here. Not fucking me. He's not fucking back here. Look at yeah, not fucking back me. Do the fucking mega. Do the Nazi fix it. Get out of Facebook. Tell you how to get out of Yeah, don't be looking freaky. I'm telling you. What the? I'm I'm imagine me in that phrase. Keep down the phone. Down to the garage station. Imagine me in that phrase. In the first video, it is very clear that the National Party activists were doing absolutely nothing that should garner any attention before the coward behind the camera decided to approach them. And in true leftist fashion, the unpleasant idiot labels the men racist bigots and proceeds to follow them in an attempt to intimidate. It must also be said that the National Party activists behaved very well, considering the badgering buffoon in pursuit, who also mentioned towards the end of the clip that they may get ran out of town, a threat to any reasonable person. Although the behaviour of the protesters is much more threatening in the second video, I think it is safe to assume that the people behind the camera are mentally retarded. And again, it must also be said that the National Party activists behaved very well, considering the harassment endured. And like good, decent citizens, they reported what I believe is a criminal offence to the Gardaí. While those of us who value freedom will view such despicable behaviour with the contempt it deserves, Ireland's leftists celebrated the deranged protesters who confronted the peaceful nationalists. And it should go without saying that such celebrations are indicative of a society made up of truly stupid and dangerous people. A sad fact I find myself alluding to regularly on this channel. But I'm not here today to spread a message of tolerance or to educate people on the harm that has been caused in the past when liberal values were abandoned for authoritarianism because those who need to hear such words are too stupid to understand them. Instead, I will say the following. My name is Michael Connell. I wore the uniform of an Irish soldier for 21 years, and I served my country well. I am a radical believer in freedom, and I have rightfully developed a strong sense of entitlement considering my sacrifice to Ireland and her people. That being said, if you ever happen to see me promoting a political message in your progressive town, a message that fills you with rage, choose your actions wisely. I would advise that you approach me with a sense of gratitude and caution before you offer disagreement. And please, do not attempt to intimidate me or offer violence, because I promise you, my response will not come in the form of peaceful restraint.